ವಿನೋದಿನಿ ನಂದನು ತೇ ಗಿರಿವರ ವಿಂಧ್ಯ ಶಿರೋಧಿನಿ ವಾಸಿನಿ ವಿಷ್ಣು ವಿಲಾಸಿನಿ ಜಿಷ್ಣು ನುತೇ ಭಗವತಿ ಹೇಶಿತಿ ಆಸನ whether i need to sit on the floor i need to sit on the chair if i sit on the floor what asana i should use if i sit on the chair what whether i could be able to sit whether i get a, you know any problem with sitting on the chair because in india it is something people want to sit on the chair on the floor only they feel that if i don't sit and do the sadhana you know but if i don't sit on the floor and do the sadhana i don't get a so mentally we are pre- you know conditioned i can say but it has nothing to do you can use a padmasana siddhasana sukhasana and do it on the floor if you want or you can sit on the chair if you have a knee problem you have a overweight you cannot sit on this or you are knee you you are not familiar sitting on the floor then you sit on the chair and do the sadhana is it clear to you sadhana should help you to go into a deeper level of consciousness right if you have a problem with the knee you are sitting on the floor and you are meditating your leg is paining where your attention on the leg or in the divine mother so be careful your asana should be support you to go deeper into your meditation so it is asana so it is not necessary you have to sit there you can sit on the chair only condition is your spine should be straight please understand this is very important it is a damn cold outside floor is also very cold you are sitting there if you are in abroad you are sitting on the floor do you focus meditate on the floor or on the divine mother you know it is very difficult you have to so best asana is that is support to you support you to your meditation so sit with the spine straight and second thing is use a woolen mat or the wooden block so that that can disconnect you from the earth element you from the earth element because we are interacting regularly with the earth magnetic field earth magnetic field. when i sit in the meditation i should be able to receive the energy hold the energy until i cleanse heal balance and connect and energize then if i come out it's okay a balanced i am you know received whatever energy i absorbed if some energy discharges after meditation it's okay but during meditation i am receiving and energy is dissipated into the earth what you gain people are meditating one hour on the floor what is the result energy is coming and going you are same as it is the same as it is so use a wooden block that is a non conductor of electricity or energy or woolen mat or silk cloth you got this point use that and if you are sitting on the chair keep that woolen mat or the mat like this type of mat is also okay carpet is also okay carpet mat so that it is it should be below your feet and the chair should be of wooden not a metal one because metal is again conductor of electricity it will receive the moment i sit and meditate my energy is flowing here i am energizing my chair not only myself got this point so it should be wooden is better and your asana should be on the you know on the chair or there very important your spine should be straight that is only the